another great video by the great Miss Mojo. Oh, I love this channel. Uh, joking, of course. Uh, this is the top 10 memorable gradu graduation songs, and yeah, the thumbnail is Vitamin C. Who has the song Graduation Friend Forever? She's a one and wonder if you didn't know. Uh, yeah, really cheesy fucking song. Um, I expect everything to be shit on here because it is mostly gonna be, I think, pop punk or mostly uh, around songs that are around the, the teen demographic. So I'm probably not gonna like anything on here, but we're gonna see. And I hope you will enjoy it. So cheesy. This fucking bitch shows. Why? I'm not subscribing to a shitty channel. Ms. Mojo is the worst. Jay Z, no. How is that a graduation song? What the fuck? What the fuck? How is Miley Cyrus on there? Okay, no. I'm getting a I'm getting a headache already. Yeah, but that isn't how it works. You actually have to work hard for your uh, dreams to achieve them. Rather you hate early Miley or the Miley that she is today. She's fucking shit. I, I, I mean, let's be all honest with each other. She has a new record out, right? Who do? Who fucking cares? Who fucking cares? I mean, how 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 are you gonna follow up Miley Cyrus in her dead pass? How is anyone gonna do that? That good of a record, right? Fuck all Miley Cyrus. Miss Mojo, you're not inspirational. You're just saying shit that has been said a thousand times already. Why do women kiss the wall with their lipstick? Why do they do that? Why is someone taking a picture of? What the fuck is this music video? No, not this song. Not this fucking song. It's so generic. So boring. Uh, what is this? Number eight. I will remember you, Sarah McLaughlin. As that last day of high school inches closer and closer, the tint on every senior's graduation goggles grows more and more rosy. Every experience over the past yeah, she's actually all right. feels that much more magical. She has some good songs under her belt. She has a good singing voice, she can play piano. What, what do you want more? Yeah, 
よ。Charlie Puth is one of the worst falsettos ever, and Wiz Khalifa is just shit. Just one fucking junkie that smokes all the time and looks like a fucking <sighs> a, 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 a homeless person. I fucking hate the Fast and Furious movies. Fucking hate them. I mean, there are eight Fast and Furious uh, um, movies out, I think. The fuck. The fuck. Yeah, guys, I know Paul Walker is dead. You can shut up now. Some people think, uh, well, don't have any comments of them yet. But some people think uh, when they watch my videos that I'm I'm a really pretentious dick or I'm uh, really senseless if it comes to uh, celebrity deaths. But the thing is, uh, now with Chester Bennington, who I'm not gonna say a lot about because I know a lot of people are heartbroken by that. I, I was heartbroken when I first heard it, but I moved on. Uh, I, I knew it for a week or two, maybe a month, and I thought to myself, yeah, the guy is dead, move on. But we're three months, um, I mean, Chester uh, passed away in July. And we're now in October. So, guys, move the fuck on. The guy is dead. You can not really do something about it. He hung himself. I understand that everyone wants to uh, tribute Chester and wants to show the love. But, I mean, three months, really, a quarter year. How long is this gonna last? That, that is the only thing I'm asking. I know the guy is dead. Uh, I'm sorry for his family, I'm sorry for himself, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, let's just watch the video because I'm gonna get a lot of hate for that, but the guy is dead, I, I know, Paul Walker is dead, Chester is dead, everyone is fucking dead. Fucking hell. Why are they playing instruments on stage when the only thing you hear is one fucking piano chord all the fucking time? The fuck? Air instrument, right? They don't even play their instruments. Fuck off. Actually, um, is fun still around? I think not, but I'm gonna work. I'm gonna look. I believe they're not together anymore. I believe they're not together anymore. Uh, no, no, they're not. Uh, they have. Aim and Ignite, and they have some lights. Um, yeah, sure. Don't really care about the band. Two albums, sure. They have a song Walking the Dog. Fucking normies. Uh, and then some lights, which is their last one. Yeah, and they're both alright. Oh, and We Are Young is on there as well, carry on. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, 
uh, don't really care about fun, but hey, not the worst band, uh, I guess. Number five, closing time, semi-sonic. Open all the doors. Um, Sonic Youth? No, something with Sonic. Semi-sonic. Uh, I guess they're all right. Not the worst. This fucking song. When you're young, everything feels like it will never end. But just because high school couldn't last, it doesn't mean we shouldn't be friends forever. The song is a bit of a contradiction. It's all about accepting that people grow apart and things will forever be different. So you should say everything. It's so cheesy. Fucking song. Good movie, good movie. One of the best team flicks ever. It is a good song, don't get me wrong, but the same thing why I get to hate a song eventually because it is overplayed over and over and over. And that is mainly the thing why I'm hating a song. Or it is just shit, but this is a good song, but just way too overplay it. This song. Yeah, um, uh, JC tried to cover this song. It is fucking horrible, but the original, it is a classic. It it is called original for a reason. JC fuck off. Hey, how how can I ruin a classic song? Hey, I know. Feature me on it, and bam. I've destroyed it. JC, fuck off. <laughs> Just play the Nashville version. Challenges life has to offer and hope for the best. 
before we reveal our top pick, here are some honorable mentions. Little Nickelback. <laughs> Miss Mojo, you're taking the piss right now. Fucking hell. If you like Nickelback, what the fuck? <laughs> 100 years, 5 for fighting. The fuck is the name, FFF? I mean, Foo Fighters isn't the best name, but 5 for fighting? What the fuck? Goodbye to you from Michelle Branch. Oh, she's so pale. Please fuck off. Oh, this is number one. Number one. I had to see this one coming though. Yeah, I actually donated this song. It is overplayed, don't get me wrong, but yeah. It is actually a good number one pick. Good job, Miss Mojo. Good fucking job for once. This iconic Green Day song is a big step away from the punk rock band's usual sound. The gentle simplicity of the acoustic guitar accompanied only by a violin. And the hopeful and melancholy lyrics makes this the perfect rad song. So take the photographs and still friends in your mind. And of course, they fucking good at the end. Miss Mojo, suck a fat one. Um, yeah, I'm gonna leave it with that. Miss Mojo, fuck you. Number one was good. Uh, the other picks really hit or miss, mostly fucking miss. They're all garbage, except for Green Day. They're pretty good. Um, yeah, let me know your top 10 in the comments down below if you have one. And take care. And Miss Mojo, suck a fucking fat one. Fuck Miss Mojo, horrible channel. But if you want, uh, if, if you want me to do more, if you want to request more by them, then do it. But just to let you know, it is a fucking horrible channel. <laughs>